Hey kids, my name is Kevin. I am the host of the Kevin, Virginia and Jason show on 97.9 WRMF. Now I'm going to read you guys a story and you'll want to listen up because on the radio at 645 Friday morning, we're going to be asking a question from this story. Now, if you know the answer, you want to make sure that you call us quickly. The person through with the first correct answer could win a donut and pizza party for your class and the GameStop game bus could come to your school at the end of the year. So listen up to the story, Junie B, First Grader Cheater Pants by Barbara Park. Mr. Scary was writing at his desk. He looked up and he called my name. Junie B, he said, I'm ready for you now. Could you bring your chair up here, please? My stomach flipped and flopped. Mr. Scary took my homework paper out of his drawer. He set it in front of me very serious-like. I want you to explain this, Junie B, he said. I want you to tell me exactly why you copied May's homework this morning. I tried to swallow, but nothing went down. Um, well, let's see. The reason I copied was, uh, was... Mr. Scary raised his eyebrows. So did May actually give you her paper to copy? He asked next. Next. I rolled my eyes at the crazy question. No, silly. May would never be that nice, I said. It's just this morning she kept on bragging about how her homework is always an A+, plus, and then she left the paper on top of her desk when she went to the office, and that's just asking for trouble, mister. Mr. Scary leaned back in his chair. Ah, he said. So when May left for the office, you saw her paper and you just decided to borrow it, I said. I decided to borrow it to copy. My teacher did a frown. Borrow, he said. No, Junie B, I'm sorry, but borrow is not the right word here at all. When you copy someone else's paper, that's called cheating. Cheating is any time you take someone else's work and you present it as your own. He looked at me. When you cheated this morning, you broke my trust in you, Junie B, he said. We have a rule about this in room one. We keep our eyes on our own papers. You have heard me say that a hundred times, I bet. I felt surprised at that information. That's a rule, I said? No kidding? I always thought that was, well, you know, just a suggestion. Mr. Scary rolled his eyes. No, Junie B, it's not a suggestion. It's definitely a rule, he said. And it's an important rule, too. I drummed my fingers on the desk. Okay, kids, there's the story. 645, Friday morning. You know what to do. Make sure you got your mom or your dad listening to 97.9 WRMF and the KVJ Show to win.